God's prophetic words for you today. My dear child, I have a plan for you. Don't lose your faith in me by focusing more on the circumstances. When I lead the Israelis towards the promised land that I prepared for them through the Red Sea. By seeing the Red Sea itself, they all grumbled against me. They said it was better to stay in Egypt. They have lost their faith by focusing more on what they see with their eyes instead of focusing on me. In your life, there are certain things that are happening and it may be making you lose your faith in me. But remember one thing, you have a promise from me, a promise to bless you, a promise to prosper you, a promise to protect you, a promise to provide you with what is exactly needed for your life. You also know that every word that comes from my mouth will never ever return as void. So have a faith in me. Remember, I lead the Israelis towards the Red Sea in order to open a way towards the promised land that I had prepared for them. So have a faith in me. For everything, I have a plan for you. Always remember, you have a promise. If I have given that promise, then I will do it. In this hour, some people will not be able to handle the blessings and prosperity that God is about to give you. This is why he is taking you to a place where the crowd cannot follow you. So, my child, know that November is going to be all about accepting that there will always be noise around you. but that it does not need to seep its way within you. You have goals and big dreams. So the more you focus and work on yourself, the more your manifestations blossom for you and those around you. So be mindful of your focus, energy is sent wherever your mind's eye is concentrated. So let's focus on joy, fulfillment and abundance as we step into this next phase of elevated energy. You are attracting the life you want because you are finally embracing the life you have. The moment you rel relinquished control was the moment you awoken your blessings and set forth a series of life-changing breakthroughs. Let the rhythm of your spirit continue to match the melody of the universe. The harmony you are producing is creating the most potent magic. The kind that activates your dreams. Alignment is more than just positive words and affirmations. It is the divine dance between energies and it is the frequent pattern of letting go and creating space. So don't miss a beat, move in time with the flow of your journey and believe in your heart. 
that what is truly meant for you will always find its way to you. So my child, know that when you start to see your life as a journey and have a faith in your strength, you will see that there is purpose even in your pain. Even in your hard days, there are lessons you can learn from and there are reasons for you to carry on. So while life can be uncertain and difficult at times, you are still in control of how you choose to respond. It is okay if today not everything feels okay. Some phases of lives are mean to be like that uneasy and not okay. They will test your patience and your courage to stay. They will test how much belief you have in yourself. But you will grow stronger through those days. You will find out that and if you don't give up on yourself even when the times are hard. Life will reward you with things only the bravest one deserves. Miracles are taking place for you right now. Trust that every step you take in the direction of your goals will be rewarded. The more difficult the road ahead, the more powerful the destination will be. You have been praying for these transformations. Fully surrender to the divine plan of the universe. Focus on the daily steps out of your comfort zone. So keep pushing yourself to get better spiritually, mentally, physically and every single day. So my child know that all I can tell you is it is worth it being brave, putting yourself out there, following your heart and letting down your walls. Risking failure, exploring new opportunities, choosing courage over fear. Giving yourself a chance to discover what is out there in this world for you, even the stories that don't end in happily ever after, they are still worth telling. The pain you feel as a consequences of being a tender, hurted human in a heavy world. So the hopes that sometimes ends in heartbreak and the really hard parts of living. Loving is worth it, feeling is worth it, trying is worth it, not holding back not minimizing yourself or your dreams. Not always taking the safe and easy road when you start is pulling you in a different direction. It is worth it. You are worth it. Time is fleeting and your energy is scared. Don't deny yourself the chance to truly live. So my child, know that. And it come to pass that while Apollos was at coordinate, Paul having passed through the upper coast came to Ephesus. 
and finding certain disciples, he said unto them, Have you received the Holy Ghost since you believed? And they said unto him, We have not so much as here whether there be any Holy Ghost. And he said unto them, Unto what then were you baptized? And they said unto John's baptism, Then said Paul, John widely baptized with the baptism of repentance, saying unto the people, That they should believe on him which should come after him, that is, on Christ Jesus. When they heard this, they were baptized in the name of the Lord Jesus. Lord, I have planned my strategies and figure out now how I will try to solve my problems yet. I have not consulted you. I am a fool. Lord, please forgive me. For I know that my problems are not simply problems that were given me to solve, but also burdens that you have allowed me to bear, and that the purpose of these burdens is to show me that you and only you can lift them from me. I cannot do it myself, great God, only by my prayer to you can my burdens ever be satisfied. And I pray to you now, take up my burdens while I am on earth today, just as you will take them up when I am with you in heaven, by the grace you give me through the sacrifice of your only Son, relieve me. So may I do your will while I am alive, just as I will do your will when I am together with you again. In paradise, for there are no place else, lies my salvation and all true happiness. Lord our God, rule over us in strength and grant us your light. Let your spirit be with us to confirm what has already taken place in our hearts, so that we have joy and trust even under all the strain and stresses of this life. Shine into the darkness of the world, shine for all people. May we be show more and more clearly what we have been created for, straighten our faith for the future, our faith in everything good. For however hidden the good may be, it must at last come to the light. May we and all the world bring praise and honor to you. Amen. Type yes if you have faith and trust in God. And if you want your all wishes come true, type Amen. And if you trust God's prophetic words, and if you like this video, please do subscribe this channel for more encouraging God's prophetic words.